Welcome to quantitative reasoning solution section and we have a problem on lantern steps quantitative reasoning book 4 test 15 page 87 thank you for joining in today and if you're a new subscriber kindly subscribe to this channel for more basic mathematics and quantitative reasoning solutions and learning so we have this problem we have three times five and it's indicated equals 51 but actually three times five is not 51 so we have four times six 42 we have seven asterisk four equals 14 and nine asterisk six equals 27 so we're going to unravel this problem now if three times let's try to get to find 51 3 times 5 is 15 simply reverse this number and you have 51 okay so if you need to find 3 simply reverse 51 And you have 15 and you then divide 15 by 5 and you have 3 same goes to 5 to find 5 reverse 51 and you have 15 divided by 3 you have 5 okay so at this point please if you're yet to subscribe kindly subscribe to this channel all right so let's move on to this we have seven asterisk four seven asterisk four now we want to find 14 to find 14 we simply have seven times four divided by two so seven times four divided by two is two so we have two here is two two in four we have two so seven times two is 14 okay so that's for that so to find four to find four here so you simply divide 14 divided by 7 is 2 and remember there is a magical 2 somewhere so we have 2 times 2 is 4 to find the next number which is 7 simply have 4 divided by 2 is 2 hence 14 divided by 2 is 7 so if you try the same method for this we can actually try out for example 3 let's work on example 3 and see if we're going to get the same answer to find 9 right so we have 6 divided by 2 is 3 so 27 divided by 3 is 9 to find 6 we can also have 27 divided by 9 is 3 so 3 times 2 is 6 all right so let's try to find our 27 so to find 27 repeat the same process here we have 9 times 6 divided by 2 and when you divide you have 2 can divide 2 1 2 divide 6 we have 3 so 9 times 3 is 27 so as you can see it worked for both thank you for watching do well to subscribe to this channel for more quantitative and maths problems and solutions bye